In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Plus. So Google Plus is something that you definitely want to connect your business with. It's a really powerful tool for marketing. It's another spot where you can share content. It's another spot where you can attract uh, viewers just like you would in Facebook or Twitter. It's another spot to get eyeballs that are interested in what you have to offer. So Google Plus, you can go to plus.google.com. You automatically get kind of a starter account whenever you create your Gmail account. Now, I'm on here for a Google Plus page. So this is for for my business listing and it's very simple uh, you know you can post what's new with you so this is where you can post content so um, we are excited to help you unleash the power of the internet into on your business check us out at www.countonuspr.com and there it goes and then you can click on share and that's going to share this public to our page so it's really basic uh, really simple you can come in here you can add your profile info here so you could uh, change your cover to add a logo or to change it to an image it's kind of related uh, more to your community you can upload a cover photo as well if you choose to do that um, you can go with a, a gallery of, of various images so you know I like that that mountain type scene um, that seems to work for now um, but of course you can change this up uh, yourself and then change profile picture for your business I would recommend creating one um, with your business logo or even like just the initials of your business logo so that way it shows up there and then uh, this is your area where you can post right so this is your Google Plus page for your business you can also um, go over here and just do a regular uh, Google Plus page so under on the left hand side here you've got your business page this is Google my business and then if I go back here to plus.google.com plus.google.com then I'm going to find um, this is my uh, main uh, Google account so I'm just gonna go to the profile here and this is my personal you know Paul counts page so I can post things to my circles I've got 1300 people that have me in their circles so that means whenever I post stuff I'm gonna get automatically about 1300 people here so um, there's you know lots of things you can do here from your personal profile you can go to your pages to actually view the various business pages that you've set up and um, you can also go through they've added a new uh, Google Plus as well so make sure that you follow uh, that area also so that's kind of the new look Google Plus and this gives you a chance to post content to your audience so it's very simple you just click on the right feature here and you can put whatever's new with you so I'm excited to launch this brand new Google training that I am currently recording it is amazing and then click on post and then that's just going to post it and share it with my networks. All right. So you can see here that that was automatically posted. And there it shows up. Boom, right there. So that way it automatically got pinged to people in their circles by just clicking that button right there. So again, Google Plus is one of those profiles that you'll want to set up. You can... it is perfect to add in this profile link that you have up in the browser to your website uh, you can notice how I've integrated it here on my blog for example over at paulcounts.com I've actually added uh, this under the follow me section so there's the Google Plus uh, link so when people click on that they're taken to uh, my Google Plus profile page where they can actually see info about me so uh, there they can view it they can actually check it out as well so uh, that's Google Plus for you you can also use it for your business under um, this icon here and we can go uh, by pages as well to see uh, what pages we're working from so you've got your personal uh, Google Plus you've got your business uh, Google Plus as well and uh, you can manage both listings from within the same account so Google Plus again it's plus.google dot com plus dot google dot com and that's how you access uh, Google you can also go to google dot com forward slash business and from there uh, you'll be able to have access to manage uh, your Google Plus uh, business page as well so you can edit your info you can add photos you can add all that data all that info um, for your Google Plus uh, business page so you've got a couple different pages there business dot google dot com or photos or excuse me plus dot google dot com for managing the personal side so again Google Plus is really worth setting up 
you've got the settings here which is going to share with you what kind of things um, you know can be shared on there do you want to have geolocation set for that do you want to stream um, you know content there you can choose how you want to set up your Google Plus as well you can also go back to the classic view if you want to um, so that's down here on the left hand side and that will actually take you to um, kind of what you know what's different about Google Plus what's changed inside of uh, the Google Plus network so there we've got uh, my Google Plus page here you can see how it looks to other people you can see if you know other people in my circle what they've posted as well and um, you can also from the navigation here on this other version of it on the left hand side you'll see pages that's where you can manage your business pages that's how you can set that up you've also got like communities in here that you could join and be a part of so there's this is a joint venture marketing community there's a YouTube community there's a hip-hop network there's um, multiple other groups that you could join you can also create your own Google Plus community that'd be a really good way to connect with people and really reach out to people if you created your own community and you could make it a public community and I could make a public community of internet marketing internet marketing experts anyone can join yes anyone can join and then choose um, let's say internet marketing tips and tricks create community and so that's loading up here finish setting up your community click done I can choose a photo here so excited to announce my brand new Google Plus community called Internet Marketing Tips and Tricks. Now the same logic goes here for setting up Facebook groups as well. So the same, you know, logic extends, you know, there also. So that's where you're wanting to put in um, you know, I'm tagging people right now who this is going to go to public, extended circles, my circles, internet marketing, and then uh, let's see also send an email from you to my circles and then click on share and then this is going to announce to everybody via email that I've just created this new group and this is a chance to share uh, really cool insights with people really cool um, unique things as far as you know what's coming up things that have changed um, it's a great chance to connect with your audience and so same thing with Facebook groups you set up Facebook groups so you can reach your target audience you set up a Google Plus community for the very same reason and uh, so Google Plus has got lots of possibilities they've got communities you you can set up events in there as well under your Google Plus profile. So that could be, um, you know, special events that other people have. You could plan a hangout. You can create a new event um, that maybe you have coming up as well um, that you could post about to invite people to. You can do the hangouts from there and actually schedule a Google Hangouts um, that we've already discussed. So there's lots of options there absolutely love uh, Google Plus it gives you a lot of functionality it's something that sometimes we miss and it's something you should be leveraging in your marketing uh, more freely